Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you this sling bow which I made. So as you can see it's a sling bow, so it's powered by rubber here and this has got four layers of some tapered TheraBand gold on either side. So that's got a lot of draw weight which is easy enough to propel these two bolts which I made. You also may have noticed that I've fitted an optical air rifle scope on the front and I think this has got a times four zoom. This scope is actually accurate and I can hit a target about 15 meters away. The trigger mechanism works by the loop in this string coming all the way back and hooking over the trigger and then it's being pulled like this and then when you pull the trigger it releases the bolt like that. So if you want to see how to make this sling bow, I'm going to have a tutorial up next weekend on how to make it. So subscribe so that you see when I upload that. So these are the two bolts which I've created for the crossbow. You can also use cr commercial crossbow bolts or arrows but I don't have any of them. So this first bolt has just got a sharpened nail glued into it there and it's got some flights on the back made out of duct tape and it's got a notch for the string to clip into. This second bolt's got some thin stainless steel as the broad head on the front and this bolt's probably the most lethal of the two and it doesn't need fletchings or anything because it's very front heavy so it will fly straight and it's also got a notch on the back for the string to clip into. So now let's see how you load and shoot the weapon. So this is how you load the weapon. You put your foot on the stirrup piece like that and then you grab the bands and you pull them all the way back and up over this trigger mechanism and hook them on like that. Then you grab your bolt, you push it forwards and then you notch it. Then you just point it at whatever you want to shoot and fire. As you can see, that was a solid hit and it penetrated all through three milk cartons. So as you can see, the bolt easily penetrated through the milk carton and very deep into the cardboard. So the bolt penetrated all the way through the milk carton, all the way through the cardboard and into the wooden board that I've got behind. So it went in so far that the nail is stuck in the board and I'm going to need to take it out and re-glue it back into the bolt. So thanks for watching this video guys, I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did please hit the like button and subscribe. Also if you have any recommendations for a future project which you really like me to make, just send me a personal message or leave a comment down below.